Hello there, everybody, and welcome back to more Backpack Hero. The game has updated. Uh, there's a new little, fun little splash menu screen with some new music, and then you can also uh, pick up the stuff on the ground and then, like, stack it, <laughs> which is nice. It's very nice. Um, recommend you go check out the Kickstarter for the game. It's only going to be live for another, like, 20 days or something like that uh so if you want to get in on some early rewards and such when the game goes live next year uh then you're gonna want to take a peek at that right now but um, i'm having a blast with backpack Pe hero unfortunately i am gonna tell you today will be the last episode uh that we play in this little uh kind of beta version of the game uh i've been I'm, I'm just swamped on games right now, uh, and since this is still like a really, really early access uh, version of the game, I can see us playing it a lot more uh, when it when it fully releases. And there's a ton of content in this game right now. Um, I know I haven't even seen like half of the stuff in the game. Let let's go let's go left and right. Is that is that smart? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. What are these cleavers? They're a weapon, on use, deal three damage. So this is just a worse version of our sword. Okay. Um, this is a zero, zero cost, five damage. Um, when armor is present, it gets minus damage. So I'm gonna tell you, th this is actually kind of sick. Um, and I'm gonna take this other cleaver too, just for like kicks and giggles primarily. Um, and then, I mean, I'll I'll take the heals, I guess. I don't know, 10 damage to all enemies. Eh, screw it, I'll, I'll, I'll take this. That's fine, and then take the money. Okay. But anyway, I got other games that I gotta cover. Um, This was always supposed to just be a mini-series. In fact, it was kind of supposed to just be a, a one-episode thing. Um, and then I enjoyed the game, like, way too much uh, to not play a wee bit more. Hey, new, new floor layout as well. So, uh, fear not if you are a, uh, backpack hero connoisseur. Um, okay, so we should use this on you, yeah, and then hit you for seven. Lovely. That's very good. That's very good. We could also, I mean, we, we could consider, and I know it, it crazy, right? I could consider dropping the sword, keeping the cleaver, because it takes up less space. It also does four less damage, but... Um, I'm mainly seeing if perhaps we could end up finding some kind of cleaver synergy, right? That That's where things could get really wacky. Um, I'm gonna get stupid, and I'm, I'm gonna expand in, like, the strangest ways possible. And keep this going. So, item gets, uh, all multipl modifiers multiplied by 50%. It's a 3 damage to all. Um, and then we do have armor now. So... Do you want to stick with your cleavers, or do you want to uh, get a little weird? I'm going to get a little weird, okay? I'm going to stick with the, the cleavers, which is not exactly what I was saying prior, but that's okay. I'm going to take this, I'm going to take this, and then remove 100% of all status effects. Just give me the luck. Give me the luck, okay? I'm running no armor to keep our, our cleavers happy and healthy, um, whether or not that's a good idea or not. I haven't quite figured out yet, but now we have three, like, pretty unique, you can only use this once per turn, haha, <laughs> we, we have three pretty unique weapons, right, which puts us into a, a, a really kind of fascinating scenario, where, use ya, and then smack ya, okay, where we don't actually do all that much damage, but the damage that we do, I, I like. So we smack you, we hit you. This hits for three, this also hits for three. We, we gotta get something to stack our machete. If we don't get something to stack the machete, we're, we're gonna get upset in the future. We, we need some kind of buff on this guy. So, hit you. Unfortunately, we will we will not uh, we, we, we will not kill him on this attack, but we'll kill him here. This is still going fine. Um, so this is another machete. Fantastic. Uh, heavy item creates a drink and a space that is in this row. Okay, or we have a two banger shield that adds eight block. So this is just strictly better. I'll take the key. And then I don't really care about the disgusting food. 
And I don't really have space for the keg. And it, it costs damn three mana in order to... Or is that cost three money? Oh. Well, Lottie freaking da. Okay. Well, that's that's something. Honestly, that's something. Um, get, give me this for now. I, I I can vibe with this. We've got ourselves a a table as our shield now. I I can live with this. Do you feel lucky? I do. I have six guesses remaining. Okay. Um. Obviously, those did not fit. These fit though. What 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 a heck are you? Huh? What a heck are you? This is a medium curse? What the hell, man? <laughs> Here I was, thinking that uh, my life was, was going okay. Okay. Aw, oh, you, you son of a gun, you're gonna make me get rid of my damn key. This is... Well, this is some crap, dude. You know what? No, skip the curse. Take two damage. I didn't know it was a damn curse. I'm sorry. Finish your guess to leave. Okay, thank God I ended up getting something. Um... It's a big shield. Seven block adjacent weapons get plus one damage. Okay. Well, unfortunate. We're not going to be able to uh, see what the heck that is. Uh, you you suck, my dude. But what is this? Adjacent and diagonal weapons get plus two damage. What the heck? That's so good. Okay. So put this up here. We're going to put this right here. This right here. Oops. They're all so much better. Okay. I, I like it. I like it. That's a very, very nice little addition um i am gonna go to the lock door that's correct i'm gonna use this damn key open the door uh what kind of loot what kind of loot you got hiding in here you son of a gun you've got big big shield don't care what are you gold shiv can be used once per turn on kill a non-summon creates two gold okay well you know what dude it costs freaking zero so pretty easy decision in my book um 25 block i'll tell you that's better than this too okay we we got a like hardcore damage run right now like we just do a lot of damage to a lot of people so smacky you for seven and then this is doing four so this is doing four as well so this is 12 this is doing five okay so you know what smack you once then smack you, smack you, and then pop the shield. Okay. I mean, dude, that's effectively 20 damage that we're, we're punching out right now. That's not bad in the slightest. So, I kill you, and then we shiv you. That creates gold. Ah, oh, dude, this is, this is gonna be, this is gonna be very, very nice for me. It's gonna be very nice for me. Okay. When you're dealing with multiple enemies, obviously our machete is pretty okay. When you're not dealing with multiple enemies, it's kinda who gives a damn about the the machete. Unfortunately, I am forced to kill you without this. Just kidding, I can kill you with that that those four. Yeah, okay. Yeah. This is this is really nice, man. This is really nice. Now, obviously we are not running I'll, I'll take the extra energy fish. We're not running a armor-related build, which is going to get kind of scary. It's going to get kind of scary as time goes on. But I'm just going to hope that we have things kind of in a position. I'd like to gain some max HP. We're just going to hope that our damage outweighs the, the damage we're taking, right? Well, there's not much that I can really do besides that, so... I'm going to hit you for seven. That costs zero. Then I'm going to hit you both for a disturbing amount. We're going to kill you with the shiv. And I'm going to hit you for five. Okay. Is that like the best possible turn that we can have? I have no idea, but I like really think it might be. I really think it might be. As long as I remember, use the cleaver instead of this. If you're only dealing with one enemy, we're in business. Kill you, more gold. Ah, dude, it's, it's really solid. It's really solid. Okay. I would like to open up space over here so that if I get things like a shiv, for example, then we can do something like this. And all of a sudden, your boy is freaking cranking right now. He's freaking cranking. And I'm, I'm a big fan of this. Give me the block. 
and adds an energy. I'm, I'm chill with that, and then you can throw the mug. So I'm I'm chill with all this. Give me the wheel of Isaac. What what do you got going on? You're selling stuff. Okay. This is a water flask. Adds energy. It's on sale for only three. That's that's pretty good, dude. That's pretty good. Okay. I don't need this today. I don't need this today. Um, and I already got a 25 block potion, so you know what? Let's let's buy what what is this? Floaty item. Don't care. I'm I'm gonna buy the water flask. And I think that that's, that's fine. This is great, right? For each adjacent item destroyed, it gets plus two block. This combat um, adds five block on a given turn. There, there's a lot of reasons to, to roll something like that. But I'm a little, I'm a little psycho. I'm a little psycho. Okay. First things first. You smack. You smack. And then you'll smack. Smack smack it it requires some brain function i'm gonna tell you it requires some brain function to get all of this correct but in the end i mean dude it's is actually so good i did this wrong and i would have i mean honestly it doesn't really matter i'll just i'll just kill you this turn instead and get my uh, money bonus we're getting so much money dude it's fish sword frick dude do I break the frickin' bank in order to get my fish sword back? It's so good, but is it actually better than anything else that we have? Dude, I'm gonna be real with you, it's probably better than this, right? I mean, it is, like, probably better than this. So I might as well, and then if I want to uh, pivot to a, a fish-based economy sometime in the future, then we pivot to the fish-based economy in the future. Right now, he's doing 10 freaking damage, dude. I mean, dude, you can't knock that. You can't knock that. That's incredible. Obviously, this diamond is, like, really good, right? It's really good. It's also conductive. I don't know what the heck that means. I suppose maybe I should get a uh, orb again in the future and then see what exactly that that does mean, but that's fine. Four damage to all enemies when an adjacent uh, weapon is present. This gets minus three. We don't care about this. In fact, this is like a horrible item in, in my book. Still running no armor. Whether or not this, this proves to be something that is good in the future will remain to be seen. I, I think that we're creating some questionable life choices on this one. Um, but it's, it's all for good fun. So, <laughs> what, what do you do here? Um, I'm going to ensure I don't take damage. And then I'm going to hit you for 10. And I'm going to hit you for 4. And I'm going to hit you for 7. And I'm going to hit you for another 4. It's still great, dude. I mean, it's still great. E even only getting one play of it each time. Really difficult to knock it. Hit you, kill you, give me my money, get the hell out of here. It's so good, man. So, I don't need more cleavers. What the hell is this rocket? Moves forward until stopped. When destroyed, deals zero damage to all enemies. Each item it destroys, this gets 10 damage permanently. What? I don't, I don't need this. <laughs> <laughs> I I appreciate this, I do, but I don't I don't need it. It's time to get rid of the lucky ring. I, I don't think I care about it anymore. Not just kidding. You know what the lucky rings? Not just kidding. I don't think I care, but I, I'm gonna keep the lucky ring. Okay, j just chill. I'm I'm good with this. More free hatchets would be sick. So like this guy, right? We we like him. So get rid of our paid one now, because now this is a lot of free damage. Then you're going to get rid of that to add another fish. Honestly, eh, no, you know what? We, we have another way to get energy, right? Our, our water flask gives us energy. So this is 7, 4 is 11, another 7 is 18, and another 4. This is 22 free damage a turn. Paired with this guy who's doing 12, that's 36 plus, did I say 22? That's like 60 damage in one turn if we want to go with a, a damage play. 
I am really, really finding it hard to believe that this is not the best case scenario. So like, yoink, 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 you're dead and I'm, I'm cruising, right? Really difficult to believe that's not the right play. Okay, uh, gonna be real with you. Adios, I don't care about any of this. Not, none of that is useful, I'll fight this. This is where things are gonna get a little bit spicier, but also like, not really, cause guess what? Um, oops, 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 you're dead already. And then oops, oops, and then another oops, you're dead on the next turn. Oh, <laughs> uh, dude, hold on a second. We, we got something, we got something great going on here. Open up more slots around the diamond and the fish. You, you want to make sure you get more fish. So we're, we're good with this. Diagonal weapons get one vampirism. So... What? Let's put that there. That there. So he gets vampirism. But... Nothing else does? Okay. Let, let's, let's go back to that. Let's think about that in a second. When combat ends, creates two gold. I get gold by breathing, so I'm not really concerned about that right now. So you're currently just hitting... See, the problem is this diamond. I would have to reorganize this to be like this more. Something like this. And then at least these guys get vampirism, which is not horrible. But then I have to imagine that there is some better way to do this. And I think it's like you start moving the fish... So that's hitting everything. It's like, we need these two to become one. <laughs> we need them to become one, which is not ever going to happen. So just, just chill for right now. I don't love this, but I, I do think that, I mean, we didn't get worse, right? We did strictly get better, um, but whether or not that strictly better is great or not, I don't know. So I will take the, the full health or max health uh, addition. Unfortunately, you're just gonna die, my dude. Um, it's it's a sad, twisted world we're living in when I can just body these people. So 10 damage gets anchored for two counts. Dude, who cares? Who cares, right? Just just take another fish. <laughs> just take another damn fish. This does 14 damage now. I was like, how, how are you mad about that? I'll give you a hint. You're not. In fact, I don't even need this food. G give me, give me, uh, my lucky ring back. I'll take the disgusting food. I'm, I'm chill with this. I don't need that gladiator sword. The gladiator sword is uh, a big, it's a big freaking joke. Um, so what's your deal? Give me max health. I'm chill with that again. I got 55 health, man. 55 health. I got a ton of energy related things in my, uh, inventory. We're, we're gonna fight a boss, and I'm gonna be real, we're gonna obliterate the boss. It's it's not even gonna be close. You're, you, this is not who I thought you were. What's your deal? Um, so when I use a shield, he adds one rage to himself. I'm gonna use one shield, and then I'm gonna smack you. Right, then I'm gonna smack you. Shiv you, one, two, smack you. Take six damage, see how much I care. You're gonna spawn enemies. So now you go boom, 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 and boom, and he's dead on the next turn. It is freaking cracked. Like, it is, it is actually alarming how damn good this is. Um, so do me a favor. I can't kill you and get money for it. Um, well, I suppose I could. I just waste uh, a little bit more, but I don't mind. I don't mind. Uh, smack you once, let's shield twice. We can take our damn sweet old time with this guy, because guess what? Uh, he's roasted and toasted and dead as hell. Holy lordy. Okay. All shields get this effect applied. On use, adjacent weapons get used. But they all get minus one damage. Okay. Okay. This doesn't work for our build. This doesn't work for our build, and I'll tell you why. We got too much crap that requires being next to weapons. And and too much crap that requires being around the damn fish sword. So, let's not worry about that. 
Um, all weapons get this effect applied. On use, this item gets minus one damage permanently. But all weapons get 200% bonus damage. So every time I use a weapon, it loses a damage permanently. But this is going to hit for 28 the next time I use, and then 26, 25, 24, pretty much down until it's not possible anymore. I just don't think it's that good. I don't think it's that good. All weapons get this effect applied. For each adjacent or diagonal consumable, this item gets plus one damage. This is insane. So we're gonna take this. This now does 18 damage. Yeah, that does 18 damage. This does seven, still. This does seven. This does four. I don't do it. There's too much going on. I, I gotta put more consumables over here. This now does 19. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And then I don't actually have any. Oh, this is a consumable, actually. But he's currently being affected by uh, this. So I'm I'm chill with where this stands. Except you might as well not have that there, right? Because we want to have as much adjacent as possible. Do I care about the spikes? I really don't. So just give me the lucky ring back. This is a rare, though. I just kill people so fast. I mean, I guess I'll I guess I'll keep. These are interesting. I, I do think that there's probably something there. And you're probably going to turn around and tell me, Hey, Tyler, you should have, like, definitely taken the other thing in this situation. Um, although, I'm going to tell you, dude. I'm, I'm going to just send it, I think. Because if I do this, this guy now does 20 damage. This guy does 9 who cares about this? I care about damage. I'm I'm running damage. Okay, so exit to the next floor. But I can use my key to go to a weirder floor. You know what? I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. I'll go to the normal normal next floor. The deep caves. I'm I'm terrified of all things um in this game. Fight the battle. 92 damage or health, I suppose. Okay. I still destroy you. Wait, that's the important part. So, smack, smack, smack. I hit you for 23 times, and then this does 5. It's not enough to kill you, so I'm going to block twice, and then hit you, and then hit you, you're dead next turn. We don't, like, I, I know we're, we're cruising, right? We're definitely cruising, we're having a good time. We don't need to go crazy. We can have fun, we don't need to go crazy. For each adjacent item, this gets plus one damage to self. Don't care. Sick item. I can see a world where that, where that would be, like, really fun and kind of useful. But I don't really need to run it. Um, in fact, I don't need any of this. I do love the idea of this. You know what? I want to know what happens if this is conductive. Right? I, like, I, I need to know. So just, just let that, let that chill, right? Let that chill. I'm gonna use this key. I didn't need that. I got 37 money, dude. I, I really didn't need the, uh, the constant money. Sure. I mean, this is useless, too. It's the next thing we get rid of, but that's fine. Uh, give me my loot. This is going well, man. This is going well. I think that we've, we've played better than what we normally play. I don't care about this. I really don't. So instead, give me this. Because that's just a free 7 damage at some point. Which is cool. Um, let's do this. Let's do this. So now, what happens with this? I cannot use it. I don't know what this item is conductive means. I really don't. But, but that's okay. Um, we're, we're gonna smack the ever-living hell out of this guy right here. Smack, dead. Then, might as well pop two block, right? Again, no need to, to reinvent the wheel. Just, just smack the way that we 
know how to smack. Just kill him. We don't need the money either. Hit me with the level up. Okay. This is where we want to start at least considering the idea of adding some armor. Right? Something like this, I think, is a, a beautiful little situation. It's a beautiful little situation. We're about to literally revamp this entire crap. Right? Okay. The wheel, I... I know what it does. <laughs> I know you don't believe me, but I do know what the wheel does. We're gonna take this helmet. And then I'm going to... How the hell am I getting this, man? Okay, get rid of this. Get rid of this. We're gonna take this. Right now, you're giving me two block a turn. You're giving me three block a turn. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. Then we're going to get rid of this to add this. So when this moves, adjacent weapons get plus five damage. That is actually a waste. That's a waste, and I'll tell you why. For one energy, if this was a free item to use, then I'd be in. But for one energy, I can give this guy plus five damage for just this turn, when instead I could just hit for an extra 20 damage. So who cares? I'm, I'm gonna not do that. Uh, I'll, I'll take that instead. But now we have a little bit of armor, and then we can start to build a, an armor area over there. I think this is fine. I think this is fine. It took me a second to figure out how I wanted to, to go about doing that, but I think that we have possibly made the right decision. It's another fish. That's good. It's, it's another hatchet as well. Get this out of here. Give me another hatchet. It's just disgusting, actually. Um, oh, our hatchets lose so much damage, though. They lose so much damage because we have armor now. Ha ha. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Frick your armor, dude. Unless... Okay, unless we get really crazy, right? Unless we get really crazy. I'm gonna literally move all of this down. Okay? I'm gonna move... I'm gonna basically exchange everything. Fish sword goes there. Then this. And then we basically want to just surround you. You're chilling like so. We'll, we'll put that there instead. Then we're gonna get this sucker. This guy is now worse. Um, that's because I, I have this fish over here instead. How do I, I want to do this? So that's only going to affect... I actually like this. But that does not fix the issue that I was having. Which is I want... Because this is just for adjacent weapons. So here's what I might as well do. I might as well do this. And then this, this, to give the most adjacent consumables, right? And then you can still keep the hat then. You keep the money. You keep the shield. You leave the water flies. But now, so these all adjacent weapons are doing plus one damage. So this does six. This is doing six. This is doing... Three. Unfortunately. Um, this is doing three as well. But now we have five block a turn. This guy is doing 22. <laughs> which is crazy. I mean, that that's a lot for sure. Um, I'm not sure this is worth it. I'm not sure the armor is actually valuable, is the problem. It might be. You know, it might be. I also think that this flask is still kind of useful as well. Um, I, I don't know. I don't know. We're, we're committing to it. We're going to commit to it. Um, so, smack and smack. He's already dead. Fair enough. Um, smack, 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 smack. You do 22? You do three. 
you survive by one hit. It's hilarious. I mean, it's very funny. Um, unfortunately, you survive. Death by a thousand cuts. You're dead. Okay. Don't care about any of this unless this is good. Adds five max HP when removed minus five. Don't care. I don't care. I don't need any of this. I don't need any of this. Th this is our build. You know what? If if it's bad, it is what it is. Um, but it's, it's my little cleaver build. We can always go for more damage if we want. Um, what are you doing? Adds five poison. Kind of kind of grody, right? Kind of grody. I'm going to kill you. Get, get this guy fricked up and out of here. Goodbye. You're adding poison. I mean, I, I hate it, obviously. But there is not too, too much I can do about that. I could have added more energy and then just, like, not taken poison damage. But I don't know if poison... I, I think poison just goes away. So, add one dodge to self. When your turn ends, remove 100% of all block on yourself. This is the best case scenario. So, goodbye. These guys all do way less damage now. Because the armor even existing is making them mad. But I also basically can take a free hit every turn. I, I don't see any way that this is not the correct choice. Like, I, I think it's actually just... Th this is This is just super winning for me moves up a space adjacent weapons get plus six this turn but this costs zero to use that's where this is different now how i don't understand how that moves if i'm being real so that that's where things have to be a little bit stranger for me is i don't know how that moves we could also go for passive block being part of this balloon. I don't think that that's necessarily the move. We got a crossbow. Kind of cool. Kind of cool. I love the idea of this, right? Where we, we could have it just float up to like here. But how, how exactly do you move? I'm, I'm going to at least try it, right? I'm going to at least try it. So this moves up one space. I have no idea what that's going to mean. And we might as well do this because it's a better item. Um, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. Let, let's try it in battle. Let's see what it does. So we click it. It moves up one space. Can't move. So it has to have somewhere to move. Interesting. I I struggle with that being ever useful for me. I also played this very poorly um i get a dodge though so it actually doesn't matter at all i'm gonna smack the hell out of you so the dodge i'm gonna take no damage that's insanely good man that's insanely good so basically if one person is attacking me nobody attacks me <laughs> that, that's cracked that's cracked very 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 good very very good okay um kill you Goodbye, goodbye, adios, sayonara, peace out. Um, footwear to the right, this is heavy. 0.5 block for each uh, situation. When a weapon kills an enemy, add three haste to yourself. I can see that being, being valuable. I don't even know what haste is, but I, I can see it being valuable. So let's remove this, add this. I, I still don't know what haste does, but that, that's fine. Then we have to somehow figure out a way to let... This fish sucks, I'm gonna tell you. Because I, I need to have this be able to move up and down. And I can't move it in the current position. So you know what? I gotta say goodbye to a fish. I gotta have an open spot that I can move it up. And then we can put this sucker up here so he gets the buff, right? This guy now only does 18 damage. As soon as I get a better fish, where he's going to get better. But now this can move up and then this gets plus 6 damage. Which I think is significantly better. Got three enemies here. Okay, so first things first. That moves up and now this does 24 damage. 
and this does nine, which I arguably is even more valuable for us. It's an interesting idea. It really is. Um, and then we could always like reorganize to bring it down, right? And then push it back up. Although that costing three is far too much. So I think we need to kill you. So good night. Then I'd like to kill you, which we, we should be able to do. Good night. And then I block your 15 that you do. <laughs> it's so good, dude. It's so good. So then if I use this, it don't move. This guy doesn't get his damage boost anymore. Very sad for all of us. Kinda don't care. I'm, I'm still happy. Okay. But now we can do something like get this bottom row going. And then we just push everything down. I love two extra fish. So push everything down. And that way, as this goes up, we can use it multiple times. We're going to put a fish here. We're going to put... <laughs> this is like doing freaking Jenga, man. It drives me insane. So then this goes here. This guy is now 23 damage, and then this bumps up to give an additional 5. I th this is incredible, right? Come on. You you got to be you got to be happy with this if you're me. And then this also now is getting the buff from the diamond. We still have ninja costume which is doing great stuff. This is making this guy slightly stronger because of the adjacency. And then we have two slots that this moves up two turns, does a ton of damage. I'm you I'm happy. Can't complain. Our only happiness right here. What the heck is you? Dark whetstone. Weapons in this row get plus one weak this combat. Can be used once per turn to add a weak to myself, but then the weakness, yada, yada, yada. Don't care. Um, this shiv also don't care. Don't care about any of this. Goodbye. Th this is slowly approaching the just don't touch this, right? Get a different item of the same rarity. There's nothing I would like to get rid of. So, n no thanks. Th this is a f well oiled machine right now. I've I've built something very special. Don't frick it up. Right? So, push you up once. I'd like to kill this guy here without spending this guy. Unfortunately, that's not going to happen. Now, I would like to just kill this guy. You're going to block that once. So, I'm chill. I hit you. I end turn. I still got 48 gold, so like I, I ain't really sweating too much here. Now, we use you, then we push you up so that this guy gets the buff, and then we kill you. Okay. That did 29 damage. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. We don't need any of this. Chill. Just, just chill. Move on. We're happy. You're poisoning me? Don't care. Don't care at all. I didn't move him. I didn't move him. I'm dumb. Okay, I'm dumb. So we, we smack you. That's going to require me to do that, but then I'll just hit you. Hit you twice. Smacky, beautiful. You poison me. Hard for me to care because guess what? Um, you're going to die now. Okay. I hope wish I did that in a different order, but that's okay. What the heck is this? Deals to vampirism? Don't care. Don't care. Cleaver? Don't care. Electric stone connected weapons get plus one damage. What? So hold on. So if I do something like this. Are you? You're getting plus one from the electric stone. So it's just anything that touches this gets plus one. I, it, this isn't that good. This isn't that good. I thought it was going to chain like through them, right? But all of a sudden I'm like, I don't, I don't think that's that solid. I'm just going to chill, man. I, I don't think, I don't think we need to do anything with this. I'll check your shop. Just because I'm I'm curious. I like the key. Don't get me wrong. Deals four damage. Adjacent cleavers get used. 
So this would be excellent if I had non-zero cost cleavers. <laughs> but in the current position, he's actually just kind of useless, sadly. Um, yeah. Un unfortunately, is it's not. See, the thing is, this would be great. This would be great if we can get these to no longer be free cleavers and instead be the other kind. I can see that being valuable. So, we, I mean, you look, you take it. Right? You take it, and then if the opportunity presents itself in the future, you, you take it. It would basically require me getting other cleavers. Happy. I, I'm I'm fine with this. I'm fine with this. What what do you got? Care to do a trade? Probably not. No, I'm I'm good. I'm good. Um take me down. Is this the boss? Or was that just one singular floor? No, it's the boss. Okay. I would love to say that I'm scared. I actually think that we probably win this with flying colors. We got 350 health. I mean, it's a lot. It's definitely a lot. Um, smack, 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 smack. And then smack, smack, smack. I didn't move this. That's my bed. I'll do it next turn. Okay. Jump it. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, three. He's so freaking dead, dude. He's so freaking dead. You got 92 health. How much damage can I actually do? Okay, how much damage can I actually do? So I'm gonna push this up. Okay, so this is two. Plus 11 is 13. Plus three is 16. Plus 5 is 21. Plus... I kill you. That, that, that's, that's the logic of this situation, is I kill you. Because 29 times 3 is 87. So you're dead. You're going to hit me for 13, which I just block immediately. And then you're taking basically a turn off to spawn somebody, which is cute, because I'm going to smack the hell out of you. And then you're probably dead on this turn. In fact, I know you're dead, but I know you're dead before he's dead. Just kidding. I didn't do any of my math correct. It's because we did, we did push that that time. Haha. <laughs> yeah, hilarious. Okay, hit me. That's fine. Does not bother me. Hit me for 14. It feels good to take some damage for once in this godforsaken game. Okay. Smack, 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 smack. Smack. You're dead next turn. Get get you the heck out of here. You're now chilling. You you cannot actually harm me. Um, I get infinite health. Dude, I mean, this run, this run slaps extremely hard. It slaps extremely hard. What are you? All weapons get this effect applied. When an adjacent or diagonal armor or shield is present, this item gets disabled. All weapons get plus six damage. You you take it. I mean, dude, come on, right? This guy hits for 29, not with the letter. This is absurd. All weapons get this applied. On use, adjacent weapons get plus three damage. <laughs> what? Come on, man. This is insane. I can't take any more of these, though. I mean, that's still crazy, right? That's still crazy. But all weapons getting plus six. I don't need the shield. I don't need a shield. Like, I'm sorry. I know that, that upsets you that I, I'm getting rid of my shield, but I don't need a shield. It, it literally does not affect me to take a shield. Okay. What are you? Eight damage, two poison to the enemy. Very cute. Uh, I love all of these uh, weak-ass, horrible items. Uh, but I got no interest in rocking them. Thanks for thanks for asking. Magma Core, welcome to the party. Okay. This is where the fun begins. Send me in. You guys got 70 health, huh? Y'all hitting for like a lot. There, there's no denying that. Why can I not use these? This item is disabled by glass bottle. When in adjacent or diagonal armor. That's my armor. But this guy is safe because this is not diagonal to this. I made a grave mistake. <laughs> I made a grave mistake. Okay. Um. Well, this is this is fine. This is fine. Obviously, it's like not great, right? It's not great. We gotta do a massive reorg after this. Um. 
because I did not realize where my brain was sitting. We're, we're safe now, but obviously 28 out of 55 is not really where you want to be. Um, good night, sweet prince. Level up. This is important. So we have to open up this slot here. And then we'll open up another slot for a fish. Okay. So these got to get pushed down. This goes here. So are you getting disabled? When an adjacent or diagonal armor or shield is present. Then it gets disabled. So I need this to be in an area that touches nothing. So there should be safe. This cleaver gets disabled, but we don't care at all. And then we'll just take some random consumable stuff. Six regen, I'm gonna actually probably just use that. Um, 12 damage to all enemies. Theoretically, I should not. I, I should not be able to have that affect me. Like, I, I, I think we're happy. I think we're happy. Just, just use this. What's the difference between this and this? Removes 100% of all status effects on self. Remove 100% of all status effects on enemies. Oh, okay. And we got a large mana stone, but I don't care. Okay. I, I kind of want to just go fight another enemy real quick, but allow me to open this. Another fish. Thank you. 32 damage on our uh, fish sword. Very nice. Very nice. Don't care about the rest. I'll, I'll check the merchant. I don't even know what I want to see at this point. Uh, cleaver. A regular cleaver. Yeah. Yeah, this is good. Um, get rid of this to add this. And then this is adjacent cleavers get used. This is still doing 8 damage instead of 10. But, like, that's fine, right? Although this is now, like, kind of useless. I should do this so that those get, and then I'll do this. Yeah, that's that's much better. Then I just need to get one more regular cleaver, because now this cleaver does 10, right? Which, if I put this guy in, he only does 5. So this is intelligent. But we'd have to pop this guy once. But it's still going to be worth it, because this is 13 plus 10. This is 23 damage and some vampirism and things like that. It's fine. It's fine. I'm, I'm overthinking it. I love the idea of electric arrows, but we're, we're going to chill on that for right now. Okay, let's fight. These are useful now. Okay, very good. So, move that up. This does 38. So, let's smack you. That's a great hit. And then 11... 11, 11, this does 12, you're dead, and then that's still plenty of actions for me to destroy you. Dude, it's a lot of damage. I mean, it's, it's a ton of freaking damage. I could pop the regen, right? Like, I, I could pop the regen and then basically just sit in the fight and let him end up dying, and I think it's kind of smart. But I, I don't need to do that. I don't need any of this. Again, in my no shield build, I'm I'm rolling with no shields. Hello, what, what's your deal? Trade food for a cleaver. Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Um, I'm going to trade you this crappy consumable I don't care about. You gave me this cleaver that deals four damage and then diagonal cleavers get used. So this is currently dealing ten damage. This is dealing seven. Four damage. Seven damage. Right? This is this is fine. Can I get like a chain of cleavers? Hold on. So <laughs> hear hear me out. Hear me out, okay? So this guy's doing 19 and then uses adjacent cleavers. So that'll use this guy. But when this guy gets used, diagonal cleavers get used. So what if there's a green guy right here as well? Does it then trigger back and just infinite damage chain kill everybody? I have no idea. I mean, I got no freaking clue, but God knows I love the idea of it. 
Like, that sounds like a damn good time. You might as well keep this, by the way. Um, because it's going to... Well, you would want to do, like, this instead. But I suppose that's, that's kind of dumb to do. Because that's only... Well, no, nah, you know what? I'm, I'm fine with this. I'm fine with this. And then you would use him... But this is a zero cost anyway, so, like, who cares? We'd rather have this. Okay, yeah. I like it. Oh, but you're now next to this. So this is gonna get disabled. Haha. -ha. So we do want to do this here because you can then activate it, I think. I don't know, man. I'm I'm out here. We're, we're wildin' right now. We're wildin'. You got 160 health, huh? That's a bunch. So that does 36 damage. And this does 32 just on its own. I'm in danger? We've reached a point where this is better than Fish Sword. What? I did not expect that. Give me my regen. So this is legitimately better than Fish Sword now. Because it's 12, 12, 10. Which is... 34? Smack? Smack. Might as well smack. It's not enough to kill you, though. Like, Fish Sword has just gotten worse. It, it is more worth it to just pop this. I hate it. I mean, like, I, I genuinely dislike it. Because I, I feel like I'm I'm cheated or something right now. Even though like I'm I'm not cheated at all. All that this really means is I could clear out this entire corner and create like a cleaver hell. I, I could create cleaver hell. Do I wanna create cleaver hell? Probably, right? Why why wouldn't you create cleaver hell? On use creates a curse. Selected adjacent weapons get 125 percent bonus damage of this combat i don't even think i can s say that with a straight face but how the hell am i going to justify keeping this damn fish sword man i'm gonna tell you i know how i'm going to justify it i'm either gonna get more fish or i'm gonna not justify it and i'm just gonna leave it like i don't think it's good anymore i think i'm, I'm officially out of it being good I think I have to just go to the next floor. Obviously, the experience would be valuable. This is all fricked up, man. It's all fricked up. We, we got a, a weird-ass setup now. That's a big B. That's a big B. Okay. Push you up. Unfortunately, I'm going to tell you, probably want to push you up again so that this does more damage, but I maybe that's not actually the correct play. I gotta kill you, if possible, and it, it should be doable, like so. Now, now you guys are not going to take damage, dude. It's a it's a lot of damage. Uh, you just spawned a lot of enemies. Okay, I need to kill these guys on their own. You do you're doing three hundred. Okay, you know what? Get hit me right here, and then push me up hit me on you twice you're not gonna hit me and then this is lovely the i'm dead how the heck am i dead dude how am i dead how did i die did he have spikes or something am i stupid oh no i'm dumb i'm dumb it's the only explanation i'm an idiot that is that is big sad we were so close to cleaver hell popping off man we were so close to Cleaver Hell popping off. So sad. Anyway, that's Backpack Hero. Um, been fun to check this one out. We'll definitely be checking out the uh, the full version that releases uh, sometime next year. Go check out their Kickstarter. Link in the description down below. Uh, worth it to go uh, see, see what's going on. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.